Karibu tena mtazamaji unaendelea kutazama darubini ya Channel one. Muungano wa wahudumu wa afya umekariri kuwa utanda mgomo tarehe 14 mwezi ujao kutokana na kile wanachosema ni kutojitolea kwa serikali kushauriana na wahudumu wa afya kuhusu nyongeza ya mshahara kupitia wawakilishi wao wahudumu hao wa afya wanadai kuwa hata baada ya kuipa serikali muda wa kutosha kushughulikia masuala yanayofungamana na mkataba wa nyongeza ya mshahara hakuna hatua yoyote iliyopigwa Ni siku 14 pekee zimesalia kabla ya kukamilika kwa makataa ya ilani ya mgomo iliyowasilishwa na muungano wa vyama vya huduma wa afya kwa Wizara ya Afya na Serikali za County. Vyama hivyo vinalalamikia kile wanachotaja kuwa kupuuzwa kwa juhudi za kutimiza mkataba wao wa makubaliano. This unresponsiveness uh, has been the norm and the greatest saboteur to harmonious working a relationship between the unions and the Ministry of Health and the counties. The strike is on and to tell our members that they should prepare as well as Kenyans that from the 14th day of July there will be no nurses, no clinic officers, no nutritionists, no pharmaceutical technologists, no public health officers, no laboratory officers in any of the public facilities across the country wakilisha wametoa wito wa kuajiriwa kwa hudumu wa afya 1020 kama ilivyoahidiwa na serikali we need to have those the 20000 being actualized so that we can have our members uh, 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 employment being done across the board aidha wanaitaka county ya nakuru kuajiri wafanyikazi wote wa afya wanaohudumu chini ya masharti ya kandarasi those clinic officers and nurses who are employed by the facility they account for more than 50% of health workers who are giving services there so the moment you dismiss them what happens to service kufuta watu 500 ambao walikuwa wanapeana huduma katika hiyo county tunashangaa ni vipi au wananchi wa hiyo county watapokea huduma ya kutosha Recently WHO came out with a plan that and a statement that healthcare are the people who are running away from their practice the most and there is a projection that by 2030 we would have lost like 10 million health workers because of poor condition and Kenya is burdened with that wakati huo huo ya mahivo vimehimiza serikali kushirikisha umma inapoimarisha malipo ya bima ya kitaifa ya NHIF kuhakikisha kwamba wa Kenya wanapata huduma bora Many Kenyans have the ch have challenges using NHF cards to access health services against the background of corruption scandals and uh, scandal bedeviling the institution. Nancy Okware Darubini